Welcome into WCSN's coverage of ASU men's basketball. I'm Cameron Neely in here with Evan Wiebeck, and today on this segment we're going to be talking about Jordan Bashinsky's production lately, or rather lack thereof, in the last 10 games. Evan, in the last few games Jordan's really been struggling, besides a 22-point outing against UCLA or his solid 12-point game against Col Colorado last time out, He's really been struggling in the post and in the game overall. What are your thoughts on that? Well, first of all, I think the UCLA game was truly the highlight of Jordan's season. 22 points, 15 rebounds is huge against an opponent like UCLA, even though they were slightly depleted with the absence of Travis Ware. Bachinski had to go up against his brother David Ware, who's not quite the same type of player, doesn't play down low as much. Bachinski was able to outmuscle him down low, creating an easier matchup for him. However, except against Stanford, where he only played 13 minutes, Bachinski hasn't had the same type of matchup since then. Especially Aziz Enjai and Jason Washburn have really dominated him down low, creating really tough matchups and mediocre stat lines from Bachinski. Yeah, Jason's been a real problem for Jordan in both outings this season. And the thing with Jordan is, Confidence is a big thing for him. When he's confident, he's blocking shots with his technique of going for the other man's shot instead of his own. He's boxing out, getting rebounds. However, when he's lacking confidence, he doesn't box out men far shorter than him or getting rebounds. He's not catching the ball, and he's not staying aggressive on offense. So if I really think he can stay confident over the last five games of the season, he can return to his previous form. For WCSN, I'm Cameron Neely with Evan Wiebeck. We'll see you next time.